In today's practice session, we will be translating Korean sentences into English. And in this session, we will be practicing these grammar elements. The first element is ayo oyo, which is present tense ending. Then we have asoyo osoyo ending, then ilkoyo ending, which is future. And then asoyo osoyo is past. Then we have some connectors, go, jiban, hago. And then we will have a lot of time related expressions. Okay, so I will the, the sentences will be displayed and then I will pause. In this video, we will not be using any timer. So I'll be just like taking a pause for a brief moment, a few seconds. And maybe you can pause the video if you need more time. And then I will just give you the correct sentence and I will explain it. Okay, so let's start. So the first sentence is this. Can you translate it? The correct translation will be I went to Busan last month. So this word Chinan means last when you are talking about time. Generally, we use it with Chinan Chu. Chu is week or Chinan Dal means last month or chinan chumal can also be used last weekend generally we don't use with it with ear e for ear we will just say changnyon changnyon means last year okay we will not say chinanyon so chinan dare chega busan ekhaseo simple right i went to busan last month let's move on to the next sentence chumare mohe seo can you translate? It's easy, right? Then the correct translation in English would be What did you do during weekend? Or in weekend. Tumal is weekend. Tumare mo hisayo. Mol hisayo. Let's see the next sentence. Tham chue uinen miguge kal koeo. Tham chue uinen miguge kal koeo. Are you done? The correct English translation would be Next week we will go to USA. Thaum is next. What was last? Chinan. So Chinan and Thaum. These are used a lot, very frequently. So Thaum Chu is next week. Chinan Chu would be last week. So Thaum Chu e Urinan Miguge Kal Koeo. Il Koeo we have used here which is future tense, will, shall. So, urinen, we will go to USA next week. Let's see the next sentence. Uri abojinen unhenge so idil hashimnida. It's easy, right? Uri aboji. Generally in Korea, when you are talking about family members, especially parents or even husband, you use the word Uri instead of Che or Ne. My. Instead of My, you say Ava. So Uri Abaji. It doesn't mean that like it's our father. It can be like just one guy talking about his father or one girl talking about her father. So my pa my father Unheng Esa Iral Hashim Nida. The, the word here is hada, so it can be hamnida, but just to use a more honorific, to be more polite, here we have added she suffix. So, my father works at a bank. That is the correct translation, right? Let's see the next one. Yojum hangugenen nalshiga aju thawayo. Yojum hangugenen nalshiga aju thawayo. Okay, let's see the correct translation. Yojum, these days, right? These days, hangugenen in Korea, nalshi ga aju tawoyo. Nalshi is weather and aju tawoyo, very hot. The weather is very hot in Korea these days. 
Let's see the next one. 이번 주말에 시간이 있어요? This one is easy, right? 시간이 있어요? 있어요 is used for do you have? So do you have time? 시간 is time. So do you have time? 이번 주말에, this weekend. So we already talked about last weekend or last week and next week. So this is how we use, we say this week or this weekend. So ibon. So ibon can also be used with ibon chu means this week, ibon chumal this weekend, or ibon dal, which means uh, this month. But what about uh, this year? If you want to say this year, oh, that's totally different. You say orhe. Orhe is this year. Last year is changnyone. Changnyone. And next year is nenyone. Nenyon is next year, Changnyon is last year, or is this year. So, do you have time this weekend? Let's see the next sentence. 저는 차를 좋아하지만 커피를 안 좋아해요. 저는 차를 좋아하지만 커피를 안 좋아해요. Okay, so let's see the English version of this sentence. I like tea, but I don't like coffee. Cha is tea. It can also mean a car. Car or tea. The word for both is cha. Cha ril chowahada. Chowahada is to like. Chowahajiman, which is but. Kopi ril an I don't like coffee. You can also use the word shiroheo. Shirohada. But shirohada is like I dislike. This is uh, just like I don't like. So there is a difference between don't like and dislike, right? So shirohaya will be a little more strong. Let's see the next sentence. Mike nun hangugoral adu chareo. Let's see the English sentence. Mike speaks. Korean really well. Charada. Charada is to do something really well. So if you do anything really well, chareo. Okay? So Mike and Mool chareo, Hangu Goril chareo. Krigo Aju chareo. Really well. Aju is very many, really. So for example, if someone sings really well, then how will you say that? Someone, let's say Mike, Mike Nan, Nuri Ril, Nuri is song. So, nore ril chareo. Someone cooks really well. Cooking is yori. Yori ril chareo. And how can you say that someone does not do something well? Not good at something? Like, if you want to say that I, my Korean is not that good. How can you say that? Chonun hangu goril chal Mutheo. Chal mutheo. Chonen hangugoril chal mutheo. Chonen yoriril chal mutheo. Chumul chal mutheo. Anything you can't do, mut is the word for you cannot do something. Let's see the next sentence. Chonen pam yol tu shiye chago. Achim yodol shiye ronayo. Let's see the English sentence. I sleep at 12 and wake up at 8 in the morning. So, chonen pam yol tu shi means like pam is night. In the English one, we don't, we haven't used night because you don't need to say, but if you want, you can say at 12 in the night. I sleep at 12 in the night. Cha go. So, we have used go. Or and Achim is morning. Yodol shiye. Ironayo. Ironada is to wake up. Simple, right? Let's see the next one. Yogi irum hago chonwa pono suseo. Okay. 
okay this is something that you will be uh, asked a lot when you go to uh, a bank to open an account or when you are filling up any forms or something yogi noon let's see the sentence first write your name and phone number here so here is yogi iram you already know iram is name hago is and thona phono thona is phone and phono is number so thona phono will be phone number suseyo sida to write yogi iram hago thona phono suseyo write your name and phone number here so that's it for today's practice session i hope you found it helpful kamsamida